I bet they have those stolen humanitarian supplies in those other bases. I should call David about this. Hello. Hi, David. It's Spider-Man. I think I may have found those humanitarian supplies bound for Simcaria. Great. Can you send me the locations? Well, there's just one... If they're keeping Sable in that base, I bet they have those stolen humanitarian supplies in those other bases. I should call David about this. Hello. Hi, David. It's Spider-Man. I think I may have found those humanitarian supplies bound for Simcaria. Great. Can you send me the locations? Well, there's just one wrinkle. They're in heavily fortified bases guarded by bionic madmen with futuristic weapons and impenetrable armor. That is quite a wrinkle. Why don't I scope out their hideouts first and get back to you? Thank Hi, David. Just found another Hammerhead hideout. Please, be careful. I will. So, what happens when we get all the caches? Put some stamps on them and celebrate at Eddie's Pizza? <laughs> Eddie's, yes. I will miss that place. He's not going out of business, is he? Please tell me he's not. <laughs> no, no. It's just... It's nothing. And do not worry about shipping. I will take care of it when the time comes. Snoring now. International anyway. I guess you could say it's a big joke found. Go on? No, seriously, Hammerhead's guys aren't great conversationalists. Back home, I was a math teacher. I wanted to open my students' eyes to possibilities beyond our village, even when the rebel uprising began. And people started leaving the village. My students still came to school. And yet, if I had known what was to come, I would have acted differently. It happened in the morning, right as school began. There were nine of them, all with automatic rifles. They asked for names, but I would not give any. The patients wore out. They raised their rifles to shoot me. And that's when she came in. Who? Silver Sable. She took out the whole group. She saved me and the children. And that is why I owe her my life. Wow. You're a heartless mercenary. Sometimes almost like it. Sometimes. Get out of our business! It keeps jumping around! Yeah! Sunlight. You picked a bad day to mess with us. What? Come on! 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 Come on!
sins now! Boy, I sure hope so. You guys are terrible hosts. Those humanitarian supplies should be around here somewhere. Time to find that stash of humanitarian aid. the supplies. Okay, David. Found a bunch more supplies here. I'll send you the location. You are doing a great thing. Each supply cache could save hundreds of Simkarian lives. Why Simkaria, if you don't mind me asking? I merely wish to help the children of Simkaria, as I once failed to help those who relied on me most. Thank you again for finding those supplies. I will come by to get them soon. Huh. Sounds like David's carrying around a little guilt. Like most of us, I guess. If they're keeping Sable in that base, that they have those stolen humanitarian supplies in those other bases. I should call David about this. Hello. Hi, David. It's Spider-Man. I think I may have found those humanitarian supplies bound for Simkaria. Great. Can you send me the locations? Well, there's just one wrinkle. They're in heavily fortified bases guarded by bionic madmen with futuristic weapons and impenetrable armor. That is quite a recall. Why don't I scope out their hideouts first and get back to you? Thank you, Spider-Man. I greatly appreciate all your help. Time to check in with MJ. Peter, are you okay? I saw people posting pictures of you and Hammerhead and Sable and... And Black Cat. Normally she brings bad luck, but not this time. I knew she was still alive. What was she doing there? Saving my skin. And giving me a lead on Hammerhead's hideouts. Turns out he's been stashing all of the stolen Sable tech underground. What? How? I'm on my way to find out. And hopefully rescue Sable. If she's still alive. Listen, I've been digging into this Simkaria thing. It's a big story. Something I feel like I need to be a part of. 
My boss agrees. Wait, you're going to Simcaria? When? Tonight. It's a rapidly developing situation. You and Sable can take care of Hammerhead. You don't need me. Just because I don't need you doesn't mean I don't need you. That's sweet. But listen, other countries are ignoring this crisis, including ours. These people are helpless, all alone in the middle of a war zone. If I document what's happening and share it with the rest of the world, it might change things. Maybe even save lives. Spoken like a true hero. But the thought of you heading into a war zone worries me. Do you trust me? You know I do. Then we're good. I gotta go home and pack. I'll call you tomorrow when I get there. I love you. I love you too. Ugh, miss her already. state-of-the-art military vehicles. What could go wrong? He took out the turret! How'd these hammerhead guys get here so fast? No reward, I guess. Do you think 
these hammerhead guys get tired of their formal wear? Nothing like taking down a bunch of criminals to brighten your day. Spider-Man, I don't care what others say. You're a hero. Attention units. Stable equipment is being taken from a supply convoy. Location is north of Houston. Over. Looks like a shipment to Sincaria. Better get it back on track. I can't believe you guys were having a block party and didn't invite your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man! situation in Simkaria must be pretty bad if I... Oscorp is sending all this stuff over. Hopefully it helps. Rockets! 
Why is it always right here with you guys? Spider-Man, you're a dead man! for a vacation. Somewhere tropical, no rocket. All units, Hammerhead's men have taken control of two Sable APCs. Any officers in Thai Village, please copy. No! I broke Sable's property. Accidentally. Totally accidentally. Take it from here, Spider. Attention unit. Officers in pursuit of stolen Sable ordinance. Officers needed in the East Village. Oscorp would stop making this stuff for Sable. Huh, must be underground. Guess it's time for the murder. Hi, David. I think I found the last hideout. Great work. So, I was thinking, maybe we should store the caches in a local police precinct. Just for safekeeping. I will prefer to safeguard them myself. I get the sense you're not telling me something. I 
had a work visa with Sailor International. It became invalid when I quit. Even an I need check right now called the deportation. I merely wish to finish this one task, and then I will go. Maybe I could help you with the whole immigration. Do not worry about me. This was my choice, and I have no regrets. Can I ask a huge favor? Sure, what's that? Remember that story you did on the shortage of teachers in the city? Well, I know someone who might be a good fit. If you had a visa. I think some of the doctors are offering H1Bs based on credentials. Send me his info and I'll call around. Hug Spider-Man, find us! I just had to follow the stench. I thought the street above us smelled bad. Woo! Time I heard that. Wait, do they even make nickels anymore? Uh, as soon as I finish here, I'm gonna look that up.
Looks like I cleared the place out. Whew. Now to find the supply cache for David. This must be the cache of humanitarian aid. Final supply caches are secure. Thank you. I will take them all to the Simkarian Embassy and make sure the aid is delivered. Let me know if there is anything else I can do to help. I will. And thank you once more, Spider-Man. Guess that's it. Hope MJ can pull some strings for him. Hey David, what's up? Spider-Man, I have the supply caches and I'm on my way to the embassy, but I think I am being followed. Where are you? I am not sure. I am... David! David! Hold on! I'm on my way! Hammerhead's men knew David would be alone and vulnerable. I should have seen this coming. Hang in there, David. Hammerhead goons be trying to get into that Oscorp truck. You guys looking to get cool tech for cheap? You should just wait for Black Pearl. Guys on his payroll. on the 
on my humility. Thank you. I think I need to look into a career change. Thanks, Spider-Man. All units, response needed for a stable supply convoy under duress. Any units in Corlear's hook, please copy. Looks like a shipment to Simcaria. Better get it back on track. Stealing relief supplies? This tells me all I need to know about your character. about this later. Maybe it'll get me on her good side. If she... has one. There's David. He's in trouble. Gotta move.
still good? You okay? I think so. Thank God for this sable armor. So, what's next? Deliver the caches to the Simkarian embassy. Thanks to you, the Simkarians will finally get the aid they need. Just happy I could help. But I meant what's next for you? Well, a few minutes ago I received a call from a school in Midtown. They offered me a visa if I accepted a teaching position. I don't suppose you had something to do with that. Good things happen to good people. I can't thank you enough. I will try every day to help my students achieve their dreams, as you have helped me achieve mine. Actually, I should be the one thanking you. For what? For reminding me why I'll always love this city. Ah, is it me? Or is the world a little brighter right now? I'm just gonna bask in this good feeling for at least the next few seconds. Or until something else bad happens. The entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. Huh. Must be underground. <laughs> Guess it's time for some urban smoking. That's a new smell. Yuck. Hope I find Sable before the fumes overwhelm her. If I can get through this without getting wet, that'd be a win. Hello! This is so cool. Whoa. Look at this place. The amount of work it takes to make this city run is just crazy. I'll never take fresh water for granted again. Okay, let's see where this leads. Looks like some loose bricks up ahead. Yeah, nice. Okay, onward. Hammerheads, guys. They've taken over an abandoned subway platform. Gotta take these guys out, then look around for Sable. You're in timeout. Yeah. Well, what have he done? What do you mean? He said he would. The boss is good on his word. Yeah, but what about this project of the stuff? I mean, he's barely even human anymore. <laughs> For what? For the money he promised us. I think we should have a contract, like legally binding. Are you serious right now? Yeah. Surprise! Huh? Are you sure you know what you're doing? Why do you keep asking me? You look like you know what you're doing. I'm assessing the situation. You've been assessing for like the last ten minutes. This is delicate equipment, okay? One wrong move, and this whole generator's fried. Fuck. Better check that out. Hey, Bellinella, you got those tickets for the game Saturday? Huh. What? Whoops! That would make a terrible ninja. all of them. Now, I bet if I follow the power cables, I'll find where they're holding Sable. Hope that's not a load-bearing subway car.
Nice. Okay, follow the yellow wire. Better not find any lions tu- Ah, tunnel's blocked. But I think I can still squeeze through. the thing like the other guys who was it don't remember his name sal's cousin i think was it messy nah he just came out better check that out what the hell is that someone needs a nap here man down Do this quick, and then find Sable. This place looks like their main base of operations. Sable jetpack. I'd pay good money to see Hammerhead's guys learning to fly in these things for the first time. Project Olympus. These. I told you, I just helped manufacture these things. I didn't design them. Guess we got the wrong guy then. On the bright side, now we got our first test subject. No! No! Don't! Don't turn it on! Please! Just give me a few minutes. I can figure it out. Now that's what I like to hear. Wow. If Hammerhead gets his hands on this thing, we're in serious trouble. The cop almost killed me. I thought you said I'd be indestructible. I said almost indestructible. After all, you're still human. Then make me less human. I'm... I'm not sure what you mean. I mean what I said. All this stuff belongs to Sable? Yeah, most of it's overseas, though. What are you thinking, boss? I'm thinking about how she took over the whole city in a matter of days. You mean back during that Devil's Breath thing? Yeah, that was crazy. Not so crazy when you got the right equipment. Well, we got those digging things. Not good enough. If we want the best stuff, we're gonna need her. Yeah, okay. How are we gonna do that? Just keep taking her stuff. She'll come to us. XRT-89. Subterranean Troop Deployment Vehicle. That's the real name? <laughs> I'm sticking with Dig Boy. Sable. Sounds like she's close. There. High voltage wires and sewer water. What could possibly go wrong? If there's one takeaway from this underground lair thing, it's that Hammerhead should have fewer thugs with guns and a lot more safety inspectors. Came back for me. 
Why? Because I need you. I work alone. I used to say the same thing. I know what's happening in Simkaria. I know why this means so much to you. You think you know, but you do not know. What can I do to make you trust me? Look, I think I know how we can take down that monster, but I can't do it alone. Damn it! You let her loose! Okay, here's the plan. Oh. Good plan. You said you could defeat Hammerhead. You, uh, know you left me hanging, right? There are medical records in here. Yeah, mostly about that metal plate in his head. Carbon steel. Super strong, pretty sensitive to... Heat! I have an idea. I, uh, solemnly swear to, uh, do whatever you tell me to. I will call soon. Ow. But, yeah. Guess I'll do some spidey work while I wait for Sable's call. Hey, what's that? All the yellow stuff. Huh. Is this some weird street artist thing? A police report. Looks like someone was killed during a mugging, but nothing was stolen. Hmm. What's with the audio recorder? So, you have some work-related stress. Well, you came to the right place. That's my specialty. So they tell me. Give me some more specifics about how you're feeling. I guess you could say I put a lot of pressure on myself. I like to be the best. Plus, I have a very demanding boss. Then what kind of work do you do? Everything here stays confidential, right? Of course. Good. Because if any of this gets out, you're a dead man. The case file says one of nine. There must be more of these out in the city. There's a bunch of GPS coordinates here. I love treasure hunts, but something tells me I'm not gonna find a chest full of gold at any of these places.
I think I'm close to another crime scene. Huh. Mystery person's calling card. Another police report. And another audio recorder. This looks familiar. I think it's the last known location of a Magia informant who disappeared a few months ago. I'm feeling a little uncomfortable. I think we should end the session. Sorry, Doc. I didn't mean this guy. I've just been paranoid lately. Like I said, stressful job. Okay. <laughs> Tell me a little bit more about your job. Describe a typical day. Mm. Typical day? I guess it starts with waking up, checking my phone, see what the boss wants me to hit that day. Then I go grab breakfast. I've been trying to do that keto thing, you know? Then I do the hits. Sometimes it's messy, so I gotta head home and clean up. I try to get to the gym in the afternoon, then dinner, and I... Sorry, um, can you go back for a moment? What does do a hit mean exactly? It means I kill who my boss tells me to. I'm pretty good at it by now. Got quite the resume. <laughs> this guy sounds like a Magia enforcer. Feels like this is just part of the story. I should keep an eye out for more scenes like this. I should be close. Hey, Peter. Just letting you know I haven't left the house. Glad to hear it. What's up? I've been listening to the police radio, and there's stuff happening all over the city, like constantly. Pretty overwhelming, isn't it? How do you do it? I mean, you can't be everywhere at once. Remember what May used to say? You help someone, you help everyone. Yeah, but I never really understood what she meant. Okay, you know that lady that came in to feast the other day with her two kids? The one who just got evicted? Yeah. After she found a job and was about to move into her new place, she told me, as soon as I get my first paycheck, I'm sending as much as I can back to the shelter. So we helped her, and now she wants to help others. Helping is like a force multiplier. Exactly. May was pretty great, wasn't she? The greatest. I'm gonna send you an address as soon as I'm done with all this, so stay ready. And bring those web shooters with you. Finally! Let's hear what the recorder has to say. So what do you think, Doc? Well, clinically, you're a sociopath. You have no remorse for your actions. You clearly are not stressed. I doubt you think there's actually anything wrong with you. So, why did you really come see me today? <laughs> You're smart. I like that. Okay, let's get right to it then. You do what I tell you, and I won't kill your family. Whoa. You want to get right to it? Okay then. I know why you're really here. I knew who you were the minute you walked in that door. And I also know that before I do anything for you, you're gonna do something for me. Well, that took a turn. These crime scenes all feel like covers for Magia hits. And if the guy on the tape is a Magia enforcer, maybe he's the one who killed all these people. Better take a closer look. Lots of police tape and equipment at these scenes. Whoever is doing this must have access to this stuff. I remember Yuri telling me about a drowning here. She was suspicious because the victim was a competitive swimmer. On the last recording, the therapist turned the tables on the Magia guy. Welcome back. Have a seat. So, did you bring me on? Yeah. Hope this takes care of your cash flow problem. Right. It most certainly does. Thank you. So, I assume you came to me because I have a few police officers as clients. You assume correct. 
But my boss and I are only interested in one of them. And who might that be? Captain Yuri Watanabe. Yuri? How is she mixed up in this? I'm afraid of where this story is going. I have to keep following it. I am ready. Meet me at my base. I've been meaning to ask, how exactly do you have a base in the city that I don't know about? Right. Good talk. Why is she always hanging up on me? Maybe she didn't hang up on purpose. We probably just got disconnected. She could be waiting for me to call her back. Or she could be running out of minutes on her cell phone plan. I mean, she's probably doing international roaming. That stuff is expensive. Or maybe she just really needed to polish her pistols. Let's apply Occam's razor. The simplest and most obvious solution is... She hates me. Ugh. Logic takes the fun out of everything. I think there was a hit and run here recently. The victim was set to testify against one of Hammerhead's men. But of course, police never found a suspect. In the last recording, they talked about getting Yuri's mental health records. Here's Captain Watanabe's file. Hmm. This everything? Yes. You ever record her sessions? No, I never record any sessions. That'd be unethical and illegal. Well, we'd like you to record a next session. And my boss has a list of questions he'd like you to ask. That gonna be a problem for you? No, no, no problem. I feel like I shouldn't be listening to these. And yet I can't stop. Seems that whoever left these wasn't satisfied with what the police concluded. are flying in about an incident in Midtown involving, you guessed it, Spider. -Man. It's the same old story, same old menace. But here's a terrifying little wrinkle. My sources tell me that the Maji of Crime Boss Hammerhead is now gone, and I quote, full cyber. First we have robotic octopuses, and now a mecked up Magia? Ugh. Whatever happened to the good old days when criminals were just put on a dime store mask? Stick their finger in their pocket and try to rob a bank. All right! Spider-Man happened! I remember this. A person got electrocuted accidentally, but the victim had ties to Hammerhead. Yuri tried, but couldn't find evidence of foul play. All of these reports are from the last year or so. But last month, Yuri assigned herself to all of these cases. Was Yuri the one who left all those recordings? Okay, Yuri, let's move on. Have your obsessive thoughts about the suspect continued? Yes. Sometimes I feel like I've almost got him. And sometimes I feel like I'll never get him. Are you doing your breathing exercises? Trying to. But? I know who he is. I know where he is. And I know what he's done. But I can't do anything. Not without legally admissible evidence. That must be frustrating. You have no idea. Seems like Yuri's hunch is that the guy on the tape is the guy that killed all these people. I think she might be right. I think I'm close. And there I remember Yuri saying this was ruled an accidental death. Food poisoning, I think. On the last one, Yuri sounded frustrated. 
You have no idea. That's it? Yes. I mean, we talked a little bit about her medication, but... When is the next session? Why? What are you going to do? I'm gonna do whatever my boss does, Mendo. Oh no. Are they setting up a hit on Yuri? Gotta get to those other locations. I'm getting close. It has to be Yuri who's leaving all this stuff. Someone fell to their death from this ledge. It was ruled an accident. But was it? These case files are getting more and more recent. This one happened just a few weeks ago. You seem nervous. Yeah, well, the chief knew I was working undercover with you. I can't afford to lose my job. Maybe I should be the one doing breathing exercises. Well, isn't that interesting? Don't worry. I won't tell if you don't. Also, you're doing great. You're a very authentic-looking doctor. Thanks. I think. You think he knows you were wearing a wire? If he does, he's a hell of a good liar. He's a Magia enforcer. We know he's a good liar. Question is, does he know he's being lied to? We'll find out tomorrow, I guess. You sure about all this? We catch him in the act of trying to murder a police officer, he gets put away for life. Yuri, what are you doing? I have to find her. Jameson really was. Yet again. Police ruled this a suicide, but Yuri had her doubts. The victim was part of Hammerhead's crime family. Hey, Captain. You ready for this? Ready as all ever be. I'm all wired up on my way to the office. Just picking up a coffee first. Okay. Drinks are on me when this is done. <laughs> Looking forward to it, Captain. Yuri's suspended, but she still won't give up. Hard not to respect that. Hi, can I just get a large coffee? Hey there, Don. Who's that you were just talking to? Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs>
call from an unknown number. Hello? Hello, old friend. Yuri? Meet me at the corner of Madison and 23rd. We need to talk. Wait, wait, Yuri! Ah, she's gone. With all that's happened to Yuri, she must be beyond hurting. She doesn't do anything without a reason. So why did she lead me on a grisly crime scene tour? She must have a lead on this Enforcer guy. It'll be nice to see her. Maybe help her deal with whatever she's dealing with. I love photography. Enforcer. Dead. And the case files from all his victims. This guy killed all these people. But does that mean he deserved to die? Yuri! I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. The system works most of the time. But there are times when it doesn't. And to me, that's unacceptable. Some people put their trust in fate, or karma, or whatever. But I can only trust me. You can't kill people, Yuri. Apparently I can. And you know what? It felt good. You need to turn yourself in. For what? I just dispensed justice. True justice. And I restored a little bit of balance to the world. You're my friend, Yuri. I don't want to come after you. You do what you have to do. And I'll do what I have to do. Goodbye, Spider-Man. Yuri! Tom, what am I gonna do? This all makes sense now. What Yuri did to Hammerhead. She's been struggling with this for a while. She's always held in her emotions. That must take a toll on her. But she's also the most tenacious and stubborn person I know. This was a bad guy for sure, but killing him? That's too much. Let's get to work. So where's this base you talked about? Whoa. Your toys are so much cooler than mine. I love 
of this invisible floating fortress thing. But now that all of New York City has seen it, Hammerhead will probably be here soon. I am counting on it. So let us work quickly. I have acquired the Class V laser array. We need to calibrate it to prevent it from overheating. Lucky for us, I'm working on my masters in calibration. Let's do this! Okay, what's first? Pull the housing array into place. On it. <laughs> Whoa, nice laser. Housing locked. Done and done. We are not done. Oh. We must reset the targeting field aerials. Sure thing. I have no idea what you're talking about. Exit the hangar and navigate to the top of the nearby transmitter. Alrighty. So, we should talk about the strategy with Hammerhead, don't you think? What is there to talk about? We find him. Then focus the laser on the plate in his head. The laser will heat the carbon steel to critical temperature, which will rearrange its molecular structure. And soften it so I can knock him unconscious. I get that part, but how do you know it won't, uh, melt his brain? When the wolf attacks the sheep, he risks getting shot by the shepherd. Okay, well, Shepard, just remember my no-killing rule, okay? Done. How's it look? Systems appear functional. Now we must test the targeting and power levels. Cool. Wait, this doesn't involve shooting me, does it? Not yet. But I do need you to launch those targets. Right. Okay, ready? Ready. Bombs away! Hit it! Pull! Just a few more. Cool with me, this is fun! Here comes another one! Nice shot! This is how modern militaries do skeet shooting? Oh, oh! Can we do one more? Please? You are a child. Yeah, well, we're all children on the inside. One more thing to do. On my way. We must adjust the gyroscopic navigation stabilizer in order to compensate for the weight of the laser. Of course we do. Go to that terminal and wait for me to activate the system. System ready. I'm going in. Okay, that should do it. <laughs> <laughs> You two teaming up now? Cute. But it ain't gonna do no good. Uh, Sable? Here's a little help here! The laser is down. Can you fix it? I am trying. Okay. I'll just do the hammerhead, that's it. Okay, almost there. I just wanna think! Sable, what's your status? Laser is back online. Hold him in place! What? Think now I can get in close. You guys just don't give up, do you? I respect that, but I'm still gonna kill you! Now I can do some real damage. This one's for Yuri! 
Give up now! Before I really... Still no respect! What's it gonna take?! Do you know what I respect? A guy who knows when to quit! Commencing bombing run! Damn! I missed! Keep them coming! I'll make sure the next one hits! I dropped the bomb! You throw it at him! It's too strong! I need to disable it first! Let's see it done! Hey, teamwork! Okay, now I'm just showing off.
That was fun. Hey, you have dinner plans? I know this great pizza place. I must return to Simcaria. Right. You have a war to fight. I do not like to fight. I do what I have to in order to help my people. I know. That's what heroes do. I am no hero. But you have taught me a few things. Oh yeah? Like what? Like how to disarm my enemies with bad jokes? Actually, they're good jokes, but I understand humor can be subjective. Thank you, Spider-Man. For everything. I don't do hugs. Yeah, right. Of course. Uh, hey, can I get a lift back to the city? I I'd swim, but it'd take forever to get the river smell out of my suit. Ready? Uh, I think the web shooters are a little tight. Get used to it. Just try to keep up. Okay, Hammerhead's finished, but his men are still out there. A spider's work is never done. <laughs>